Okay, let's stay on cars and the Gauteng Education Department will launch a specialized automotive engineering school in Soshanguve on Tuesday. Learners will get first-hand training from leaders in the automotive industry. Pupils between grades 8 and matric will be training on how to build the BMW X3. To tell us more about this, we're joined in studio by the Gauteng Education MEC, Panyaza Lesufi. Uh, Mr. Lesufi, good to see you. Good morning, are you well? Very good. Still breathing. That's the most, that's the most <laughs> important thing in life. Let's talk about the school of specialization or schools of specialization. You launched these in yeah. 2016. Yeah. Are they working well? They are. They are. What we need to know is that uh, we, we need to remove the culture of dependency. Uh, you need to create a self-sustainable learner that can survive beyond their school days. Uh, Gone are the days where learners must chase one certificate called metric. Mm -hmm. uh, our learners must be multi-certificated so that during their learning, they must acquire many certificates so that mm -hmm. even if they can't get that final certificate called metric, at least they've got something that can assist them to survive so that they must not add to the long queue of unemployed youth, yep. add to the long queue of social grants, RTP houses and other things. Because those two things, your RTP houses and uh, social grants, were just an intervention program. So, but we tend to think that they must be permanent, whereas uh, they were just intervening. So this kind of skills-based schools, they're assisting us to empower our children with the relevant skills that uh, will assist them. How do you identify the kids to put into these uh, SOSs? Well, it's performance, obviously. Uh, you, you, we have a school of aviation. You can't, uh, when you don't have meds and have yeah, all, the necessary uh, all the necessary things, think that you can fly aeroplanes. Uh, but we are thrilled with this school of uh, automobile engineering. Uh, it's something that one has been dreaming about. Um, we are one of the leading countries that are building the right-handed, uh, that are building right-handed vehicles. Yeah. Uh, but we don't have an institution that teach our children to come and enter that space. And uh, for BMW to share our vision and to agree to be our partner, but also to also uh, donate some of their motor vehicles so that our learners can learn, uh, it's indeed an exciting moment for us. Mm -hmm. And on Tuesday, we'll unveil the school, and uh, we, we are quite excited. It follows on the School of Maritime Studies that we launched last month. Mm -hmm. We are saying that we might not have an, uh, a sea uh, in Gauteng, but the reality is that uh, the knowledge of running uh, uh, the, 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 the entire maritime space, yeah, you don't necessarily need the physical <laughs> uh, uh, ocean to ocean be there, to but that, you can yeah. do that, yeah. What are the objectives here? What will uh, learners uh, actually, what sort of knowledge will they be uh, you know, getting from this particular SOS, this one that we're talking about? Well, to moment. interact with people that are building cars, yeah. uh, it's an amazing thing uh, to know how a car is, is built. Uh, or it's repackaged or it's maintained. Uh, we really believe it will bring that excitement that we're looking for within our learners. Uh, mm -hmm. Remember, if you can't get education right, you'll never get the country right. And if you can't get education right, you'll never get the skills right. And if you can't get the skills right, you'll never have the economy right. So yeah. if we can't build a strong skills base, uh, mm -hmm. we're going to miss an opportunity to give our children uh, yeah. a, a, that breakthrough. I mean, majority of us with our parents, we came to Houghton looking for gold. Mm -hmm. That gold is gone in the mines. Yeah. Uh, the new gold is our learners in the classrooms. Mm -hmm. These are the learners that must be creative, innovative, and create jobs. And Very we really true. believe this kind of partnership is assisting us uh, to ensure that our children are part of this world. Okay, it is, it is a fantastic uh, partnership, yeah. MEC. I just want to bring you uh, back uh, to where I know you've been putting out a lot of fires of yes. late. Yeah. And uh, it, there's... Uh, I want to go to Davidson now, where a high school principal has been suspended with immediate effect after it came to light that he had allegedly impregnated two of his pupils. These are problems we're seeing in a lot of the schools in Gauteng. Uh, how, are you, uh, how are you managing all this? Disgusting, I must be honest. It's disgusting. Uh, you can't have a parent uh, that is in charge performing such acts. Uh, that is why when this matter landed on, 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 on our table, we stopped everything. We mm. went directly to the school. We said to the principal, you might be innocent or what, but I don't want you here. Yeah. Uh, uh, you will defend yourself where you need to defend yourself, but you need to protect our children. Uh, we need to ensure that our children are in the safe space and our children don't feel intimidated, undermined, or used. So uh, we are pleased that the police are working uh, on the case and we have already made... Uh, evidence available to law enforcement agencies. We really believe that they will assist us to take care of that part. But as I'm speaking to you now, 
on Monday, uh, there will be a new principal in that particular school so that uh, academic yeah. learning is not disturbed. Okay. It is yeah. Sunday after all, and we have to leave it, leave yeah. it on, a lighter, on a light note. Sundowns against Al Akhli, 5 0. Wow. What are wow. your thoughts wow. on that one? I was there. I enjoyed it. Enjoyed uh, it. I really believe that they represented the country well. We need to congratulate uh, mm -hmm. them, especially their coach, Pizzo Msimani. And they must bring it uh, from Egypt. Uh, yeah. There's no way that uh, Al Akhli can come back. After five minutes, five they minutes. can't cost six, and we can't score in Allah in, in, in Egypt. So uh, let's congratulate the team mm -hmm. and, and, and say to the team, uh, that's how you represent the country. And uh, hopefully, Bafana Bafana will learn from this and represent us well. <laughs> and do the well same in Egypt. Egypt. <laughs> <laughs> let's hope so. Let's hope so. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Thanks for right, your time. Really appreciate it. Uh, that's uh, the uh, Houting Education MEC, Panyaz Alusu, which is talking to us about the, uh, the launching of the SOS, the uh, Sochangova Engineering School of Specialization. They're launching it uh, this coming Thursday. Still up.